Yeah, I think I think it's important to note that our objective with Ashes of Creation is to create an amazing game that is going to, in the words of Sid Meier, stand the test of time. So in that sense, um, you know, we're not compelled by some, you know, publisher imposed uh, launch date or some investment board, you know, coming and saying this has to be done by this day. You know, the focus here for me and for our team is to create a product that the users are going to love, that you guys in the community have been asking for for a long time, something that's not inundated with pay to win mechanics, something that, um, you know, is not predatory in monetization, that doesn't have, you know, aspects of gameplay and MMO, something that answers the call of MMO players, right? And in doing that, we want to make the best product possible. When we talk about the timeline of the game, <clears throat> I've, I have said since 2020, uh, or since the end, end of 2019, that uh, the game is going to be ready when it's ready. And, and we're going to keep you abreast of the updates, the changes, the development, the progress every month, as we've done and our amazing community team has helped to facilitate, right? Yeah. Um, so you guys get to see the game evolve and the game come to life over time. And, uh, you know, one of the promises that I want to keep is that that launch is not going to be mired in problems that 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 the game is going to stay true 